Alma Thomas, American painter and educator, September the 22nd, 1891 to February the 24th, 1978. Alma Woodsy Thomas was an American artist and educator. She was born in Columbus, Georgia. As a teenager, her family moved to Washington, D.C. She graduated from Howard University in 1924 as the university's first fine arts graduate. Thomas was influenced by artists such as Claude Monet and Berth Morissot, artists in the French School of Painting. The early works focused on still life and landscapes through the technique of Impressionism. Here, she's in her studio, along with some of her early works. Her first retrospective exhibit was in 1966 at the Gallery of Art at Howard University. In 1972, at the age of 81, she became the first African-American woman to have a retrospective at the Whitney Museum of Art in New York City, followed by one at the Corcoran in Washington, D.C. In the 1960s, Thomas developed her abstract works, which became her signature style. The title of her artworks helped to evoke the scenes and moods of her work. Today, not only can our great scientists send astronauts to and from the moon to photograph its surface and bring back samples of rocks and other materials, but through the media of color television, all can actually see and experience the thrill of these adventures. These phenomena set my creativity in motion. Quote by Alma Thomas. Alma Thomas's work inspired by Apollo's 11's mission to the moon, Blast Off, and Apollo 12 Splashdown, 1970. Untitled, 1976. Breeze Rustling Through Fall Flowers, 1968. End of Autumn, 1968. Resurrection. 1966.